She was one of the most popular athletes in University of Toledo history. And tonight, Jordan Strack talking with one of the all time great Rockets. Here's Jordan Strack. It's been a few years now since Nama Shafir stepped foot on campus here at the University of Toledo, and she really captured the attention of an entire city. She led the Rockets to a WNIT title back in 2011. She has since now retired from playing basketball professionally overseas. She's now a mom and she's living back in Tel Aviv. Her life has changed dramatically since she left the Rockets. She played six seasons professionally in the Israeli League. She got married, now has a five month old daughter named Yuval, and her life is going exactly the way she'd hoped. It's amazing and, I, and um, I'm happy because everything happened when it was supposed to happen. I'm glad I had the time to play. I'm glad, I'm glad I, I became a mom uh, at that time. Like I said, there's nothing like it. I, obviously, basketball was a very big part of my life and still is, but uh, being a mom is the main job now. Back in 2011, Shafir led the Rockets to a WNIT title and scored 40 points in the championship game. It was one of the best performances in school history in any sport. But as she reflects almost a decade later, it's not those moments she appreciates the most. I just remember everything around it. I remember the atmosphere. I remember an hour before the game going on the court to warm up and see the stands are like almost full. I remember walking um, and people stop us on campus in the mall and we felt like superstars. If you don't remember, Shafir is an Orthodox Jew. She had to get special permission to play on Saturdays. The team had to alter travel plans and meals to make sure she was taken care of. Looking back, She's still amazed at how accommodating everyone was. I couldn't ask for a better experience, for better five years. It was, I feel lucky. It was kind of luck that I fell in Toledo. Shafir fell in love with the city of Toledo, and the city loved her right back. Reporting tonight, I'm Jordan Strack.